This is a short video illustrating our sketches for a website that would help visitors explore the worlds opened up by um, Barbara's Listening Through Time podcasts. We've divided the screen into three areas, broadly speaking. There is this area where we've got a transcript and audio from the podcast itself, um, an area for exploring the clips used, and then a timeline view. On the timeline we have performances mentioned in the archives and the conductors for them. Um, and hovering over a conductor shows the performances that they've been involved with, which is particularly useful for Walter and uh, Marzal and their slightly more spread out performances. You can play any of the clips and hovering over shows which performance they record. <laughs> The interview itself is still central and um, we have a transcribed version on the right. Um, what you'll see is some uh, words that are underlined for names, so for example Klaus Tenstedt and Zubin Meter, um, and on hovering over those you get a bit of a potted biog uh, and any of the media associated get uh, highlight. While listening to the recording of the conversation between Barbara and Phil, you can also see what they're talking about, highlight, as it happens. Thrilled to, to have you here. Uh, and, and I think that today we'll, uh, let's start with the first excerpt of being you playing the opening of Mahler 5. Okay. It's okay. a favorite, obviously. Trumpet okay. player favorite. <laughs> this is, this is uh, uh, Klaus Tenschnet. Yeah. Um, performance is 1980. We've also incorporated a marked up trumpet part from the archive, um, which uh, a visitor can turn on or off to uh, follow along whilst they're listening to the uh, discussion and the uh, audio clips. <laughs> 